If you're like me, your resolution this year is to deliver your work on time. Wasn't that your resolution last year? No, Michaela, my resolution last year was to work out. And frankly, well, I didn't. But this year, I'm going to deliver my work on time. Welcome to Tool Tips, where we discover new and surprising ways to use Airtable. Today, I'm gonna to show you three different ways to identify when something's late, so you can stay on top of your work this year. Deliverables come in many shapes and sizes, but most of them have a deadline, and deadlines are important. To keep track of deadlines, you can filter down to items that are past due so you can see all of them at once. Another option is to color records that are past their deadline in an existing view. You can color them in red, yellow, pink, orange, magenta. Frankly, what I'm trying to say here is pick the color that speaks to you. Final option is to gently let folks know that their deadline is upcoming or up via an email or a Slack message, or both if you really wanna get your point across. We'll start with how to identify upcoming or late items in a view, then how to color those records in any view so they pop out. Finally, we'll go the full distance with sending custom notifications for upcoming or past deadlines. It can be useful to hone in on all of your upcoming or late items all at once. To start, make sure your table has a date field that represents your deadline. Mine is this due date field right here. To only see the items that are past their deadline, I can add a filter to this view. Only show me records where the deadline is before today. Now, this view only includes items that are late. A few tips here to make this view even more useful. Remove items that are completed, so add a condition that removes records with status done. Finally, I might want to see things a few days before they're due. Always good to keep an eye out. I can change the filtering condition to show records due before one week from now. So now I've got a view that shows me work that's past its deadline and what's due in the next week. Other times, you want to keep the context of all of your work, but highlight items that are past their deadline. Let's say I want to highlight records in a nice pink when they're past their deadline. I can select the color option, and similar to the view filter, color in pink every record where a deadline is past today. At a glance, I can see that Kai has three late items. Maybe best to reassign those to other team members. I can get even more information from this view by adding a secondary color, say yellow, to records that are within seven days of their deadline. Now I've got a lot more information on how things are progressing from an existing view. With Airtable automations, you can notify your team directly when their deadlines are coming up. To set a notification a week before a work item is due, I can create an automation that triggers when a record matches conditions. That condition will be when the deadline is less than seven days out. Now we can add the action of sending an email. You can also select Slack or Microsoft Teams if that's your preferred communication platform. I'm only going to send the notification to the deliverables owner and tailor the message to provide as much context as possible. Now I have peace of mind that owners are aware of their upcoming deadlines whether or not they're actively in Airtable. With a dedicated view, colors, and a notification, trust me, Michaela, there's no way I'm missing my deadlines this year. Let us know in the comments what your tips are to keep yourself and your team aware of important deadlines in Airtable. That's it for this week's episode of Tooltips. I'll see you back here for the next one.